hello to all of you, wherever you may be, from the Juventus Stadium in the Alpine city of Turin. And here we have Juventus against Manchester. I'm Peter Drury, and here with me in the commentary box, I'm glad to report, is Jim Beckley. Glad to be here, Peter, and I'm ready to rumble. So that's got things on the way. So, Jim, who would you identify as the key man in this fixture? Well, this guy has got great potential, and it's Paul Pogba. Not many players leave Manchester United and become better, but he's one. And not only has he improved his game, he's now one of the very best at what he does. Uh, a truly great midfield talent for me. Yes, they'll certainly be leaning heavily on him. Belts one! And that will sail harmlessly past. There wasn't much on for him, so it was worth a shot, it was worth a try from there. Oh, look, they've started with such intensity, but maybe they just need to add a little composure to their finishing. You know, it's the only thing that's missing so far. They've got it back as soon as they gave it away. And out to safety. Morata. on that Manchester by all the early pressure yeah I think they've started in a very positive manner and look hungry for goals and they'll need to capitalize on such a good spell now before we possibly see a, a reply from the opposition oh he couldn't quite make it too much on it. Fernandinho has to switch the play. Sanya. Silva. And it's De Bruyne. Oh, managed to get it away. Silva will not want to lose out here, not against this opponent. It's Silva! Decent hit and on target. Kadira gets good distance on it. Fernandinho looking for options. De Bruyne. It's a long forward pass. Looks to slip it through. He's got through. Morata! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Sanya. Still goalless at the moment. Panucci. Padui. Morata makes himself available. <laughs> Yaya Toure. Almost half an hour in now. Passes it through. Now here's the through ball. All about the quality of the delivery, and they come away with nothing. Looking cross field, changing the point of attack. Silva, and it's Bonnie. Driving on, he could shoot here. Wilfred Bonnie. Bazali gets it away. Goes for it! That was mighty close. In with a header! Decent enough try. Oh, and he's 
struck that he must have thought it was going in. Such are the margins of success and failure in this game. That was so close. Otamendi gathers from the goal kick. Sweeps it out of harm's way. Looks like a good ball through. Get that clear. Forward it goes. Five minutes till the break. Well, that's where he wants it. Well positioned to make that interception. Silva. Sanya. Silva. Fernandinho, Benucci. Patrick. Spoon forward. Morata with the ball through. Oh, that's neat. Just live for moments like that. Another really important contribution as we near half time, and it can make such an impact on each mindset. Great header, made it look easy. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no slouch. Juventus take the lead. It's going to be the final action of the first half. Not the most convincing of displays. They could certainly do much better than this. They want to keep things simple, build up their confidence, and not rush into mistakes. So off we go once more. Manchester need to get the balance right to sort this out. Ambition must be complemented by just the right amount of caution, and I think the more experienced players can oversee that. Tonta. To get it forward quickly. Morata. Whipped it again. Oh, that's not going to find its target. Oh, the ball's come loose and the chase is on. Aimed long and direct. Yaya Toure. Forty. Morata desperately wants to get on the end of this. Oh, good interception. Kadira. Manchester still behind thanks to that solitary strike. It's a throw. Hopper is the route one option. It's a good looking cross. He's had a shot. Sticks it away. Two up and threatening to pull clear. Uh, given such an open invitation, he was always going to shoot. Paolo Dybala just knew instinctively where the ball was going to end up. That's clearly been worked on on the training ground, and the understanding is, is pretty exceptional between them, and it was beautifully worked. Juventus get themselves a two-goal cushion. That second goal has such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. about as cool as they come, he picked his spot expertly. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Oh, checks on the touchline, a change about to occur. This is threatening to become a really good game.
I think they can sense a comeback here, and so can this crowd. It's all systems going now. And he's been touched offside. De Bruyne, this is promising. Well, this man's contribution is, as you would expect, proving terrific. Having that sort of player in your side is reassuring because the rest of the team knows he can make his influence count at any stage. It's simply part of his package. When he really wants to, this fella scores. Tries a through ball. Morata needed to come up with a better ball. Yeah, it looked like there that he was asking just a little too much of himself to try and thread that ball through. It was, uh, it was a bit over ambitious, but I like his thinking. Body. Sanya. Pumps it upfield. Oh, keep his ball. Bonucci. Pogba. Sanya brings it out to the flank. Navas. Fence has got rid of that. And it's Silva. Stroke it through. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Five minutes remaining now. Silva. Who's going to make this theirs? Body. Silva. Fernandinho. It's come back out. Topper can it clear. It's a loose ball. Now it's Morata. Roberto Pereira tries to get it forward quickly. And he's through on goal. Top save. That shot was travelling. And that is it. The referee has seen enough. Manchester played a big part in it, but they walk away with nothing. Would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? They've got to be prepared to change tack and, and cut off the supply. It's something they've failed to get to grips with. And, and the